What's up, guys? Welcome back to the channel. Roblox Talk here, going over our highlights again. Today was going to be a defensive player, and who better yet than to do Levante David, the longest tenured Buccaneer, 6'1", 233 over here. Mr. Consistency again, going off that consistent effort stuff from Mike Evans from the first highlight. I mean, look at this. I mean, the dude just produces. Isn't that true? Yeah, very true. Levante David, the heart of the defense. He's a guy that has just been doing it very consistently over nine years, uh, you know, over a thousand tackles combined. So he's got a lot of production to back up his resume. And, and last year I was so happy for him to get, you know, that Super Bowl win. And you see here just his ability to come off the edge used in, used in so many different ways. You know, you can rush him like this and it's pretty much an easy sack for him, but it just shows the quickness and speed that he has to, to close the gap. Yeah, and then we keep going on. Yeah. Running backs, trying to block him. Better luck next year. I mean, it's just funny to see how they used him. I mean, on the line, off the line, in coverage. Any way you want to use him, Levante David will succeed. He's proven that over his nine-year career. But again, just touch on this. You can't block him. Go ahead. Yeah, you, you definitely can. And this is a nice twist stunt game here with JPP. And again, another sack on Aaron Rodgers. So he had a really good game in, in, in this one. And Levante is just everywhere. I mean, he's just so fast and, and quick. Yeah, you can't can't block him with a running back. It's just not going to work. And then here, this is just really good awareness and his ability to take on guards, tackles. I mean, he's just he's so good with his technique. I mean, here he stands him up like nothing and then able to attack the running back, knock the ball out, and it's a recovery for the Buccaneers. Bucks ball, baby. I mean, that you just need, I want to touch on this one more time. Look at him a pulling guard. Usually this is a huge mismatch. Guard should just pummel Levante David. He's not big. 300 pounder stands him right the hell up using that leverage. Low man wins. Stands him straight up. Then gets after the ball carrier. Look at him punch this bad boy out. Woo! Buccaneer ball. I mean, the dude does everything right. Like just a true professional. I said it in the Mike Evans video. I'm saying it in this one. Dude's all over the field. Now give credit to our front seven here. Anthony Nelson getting his name in the highlight video. But knocking that ball in the air, Levante David being the beneficiary, interception. What do you like? Yeah, it's just Levante being in a spot. He he knows he has to get to a certain uh, depth here in coverage. They're playing some type of, you know, cover three, you know, zone blitz type of look. He's able to just catch this ball as it's a gift, you know, because of, like you said, the front seven, just knocking the crap out of the quarterback. <laughs> and then Levante David coming down with the, the nice, easy interception. Okay, now let's check out Levante David in pass coverage. How was he here? He's, he's pretty good. I mean, this is probably one of the areas where, I guess, highlights and media members will say, oh, he needs to come down with this ball. I mean, look at him read it, though. He's reading the quarterback's eyes, breaking down the ball, almost like a damn cornerback. Come down with that ball, he's probably all pro every year, every damn year. But we keep going on, again, reading the eyes of the quarterback, being in where he needs to be at all times, break it down a little bit more. Yeah, I mean, he just he understands, like you said, where he needs to be. Uh, again, good awareness, understanding the concepts. Uh, it just shows like he he definitely watches film. Uh, he he knows what they're running here, so he's in good position. And and Aaron Rodgers has nowhere to go, so it ends up as an incompletion. This here is really nice. Again, he understands. Okay, eighty four is going up to the next level. I got to take the guy underneath does a great job of just reading it and reacting very quickly gets on his high horse and, and makes a nice play here on the football. It's amazing too. I mean, the fact that he's literally the guy's running, he's going on immediate from dead stop to start and doesn't draw a flag, gets his hand on the ball. Hell of a damn play. Way to go. Levante David, give me that. No, no, no. Now, how is he hustle heart getting after it? We mentioned in the beginning, he literally is the heart of the bucks defense. Devin white may be the rising star, but, Levante David truly is the heartthrob of this damn team. Go ahead. Yeah, here now we're just showing his ability to fight through traffic and, and really run these plays down, whether it's east to west or, or north and south. He understands how to uh, really stop the run. Um, now you're going to see him again here. Just read it very quickly. Okay, I got to get this gap. And he attacks the ball carrier with very good aggression. Yeah, I think that's something that no one's ever going to doubt. Levante David's awareness. And the fact that you are that consistent, he is racking up tackles every year, and he's usually the one calling the plays. Devin White now is, but the thing is, he was he's been doing it for years to years. Devin White's always referenced him as the smart guy, so I mean, give credit to him again, tacking holes, jumping into the the gaps. I really like it. Break it down more. 
Yeah, I mean, he he's just he's a stud, especially when he's coming downhill. Just like Devin White, he he likes to attack the line of scrimmage. As you're going to see here, they run a nice little crisscross, and he's right there to make the play. So, you know, there was questions of, of Levante potentially leaving. I was like, no way. I mean, this guy's coming back for sure, um, and he signed a nice deal. And, and here, just fighting through the traffic like we talked about and ability to make the tackle. Uh, so here, just his his fluid – uh, athleticism to get underneath the guards and you know here sideline to sideline he's going to hit you. you know, so we know based off of nine years of seeing it he's got speed and get to the ball carrier but it just it looks so awesome when you see it in full speed I mean getting through the traffic the center's trying to get down get a chip on him no chance too fast I mean I'm going to win to the to the ball carrier nasty hit Levante showing off and we'll keep going down the line Levante and his awareness I mean, we say it over and over again, but if there's a screen, he's going to smell it out, and he's usually calling out that play. Touch on it more. Yeah, you're right. I mean, a screen game against him is very difficult. It's probably why we're so good against you know these type of plays. Uh, his ability to see it uh, so fast, he understands, okay, it's coming, and he's right there to make the play on Kamara. You know, good job getting underneath the the, the blocker there and make the tackle. Yeah, you saw again, him calling it too, but keep going on. Now big old hit, break it down more. Yeah, here it's just too easy for him. He understands, okay, I got no one behind me or underneath. I just have to pick up the running back. He sees that he's breaking off, and, yeah, this is going to be a big hit. And it's cool to think, like you just said, no one's in that little gap here. So I have no one to cover. If they're all going deep, I know my back's covered by the guys behind me. They're doing their job. I got to do mine. So he literally breaks on the guy before the ball's even thrown. He's already running towards him. He knows that's the only route that that – Quarterback has to throw to, you're done. You're finished. Get down, and I'm going to go celebrate. And Levante, again, dropping back into coverage. Very, very heady play. Look where the first down marker is. Don't get past it. Levante, what are you going to do to make sure that doesn't happen? Yeah, he's going to hit the crap out of you. That's what's <laughs> going to happen. So, yeah, Levante David, again, overall, just breaking down his film. It's it's, it's very nice to, to watch. He's just the consummate professional. He understands where he needs to be at all times, and – He's just going to be very consistent and a hell of a player, and I can't wait to see what he does in 2021. I'm glad Levante is back. And with that said, guys, I hope you enjoyed this content. we got plenty more to come, so give us a like. Uh, if you haven't yet, subscribe and, and comment down below what you think of this video and, and Levante David going forward.